about black pads? And Thor, what color of pads do you have? I have pink pads. That's not very manly. Mommy has white pads. They're not attached to her body. I don't know why. Pearl, would you like to hear the weather? Yeah. Today we have a chance of participation coming through the west side and a major crack of thunder. You said crack. My first name is Thor. My middle name is Francois. You can call me Thor Francois. It rhymes with chainsaw. We're party animals. Aren't parties supposed to be fun? Of course they are. Then why do they call it a political party on TV? Pearl, because sometimes they get out of control. Thor, listen to me carefully. On the count of three, you will do as I command. One, two, three. You will now fart. Hey, what was that? Thor, I have one impersonation. Do you want to hear it? Why, sure, Pearl. Okay, here it goes. Are you ready? Why, yes, go ahead. Okay. Well, let me tell you something, brother. What did you think, Thor? Thor, I saw a rainbow outside the window, and guess what? What? It had a pot of gold at the end. Oh? Yeah, let's escape the house and get the pot of gold. Okay, wait, how are we going to carry a pot of gold? Pardon me, but would you happen to have any butter? I need to put some butter in my sugar. <laughs> Thor, I'm scared. Don't give up now, Pearl. We've been lost in these woods for days now. I'm hungry and I want to go home. I know there's a way out of here. But we've been going in circles. Wait, do you see that? What? That sparkling thing over there. Let's go see what it is. It's so pretty. Have you heard the urban legend about these woods? No. What is it? They say it has magical stones that activate space-time tunnels. You got to be kidding. Is that what this is? It's our last hope, Pearl. Let's see what happens when we touch it. Do you hear that sound? Look over there. A dark tunnel is forming. Let's go. Bring the stone. That must be the space-time activator. Be careful, Thor. You don't want to get sucked in. Hey, look. The stone is moving towards the activator. Let's make our wish now. I want to go home. I want to go home. I, I want to go, go home. home. Come on now. Walk with me. Thor, what's that light at the end of the tunnel? We're home, Pearl. We're home. It was the chicken. Thor, where are you? Hello? Oh, you're taking a dump. Please, I don't stare at you when you're doing your business. May I get some privacy here? Uh. Hey, Thor, what you doing? Minding my own business, Pearl. What's that? It's called frankincense. Like Frankenstein? No, Pearl, it's a special kind of incense. What's that yellow stuff? That's called myrrh. You mean like mermaid? No, it's totally different. Then why do you call it that? Frankincense and myrrh have nothing to do with Frankenstein and mermaids, okay? So what are you doing? I was going to have some alone time, but apparently that's not happening. You mean alone as in by yourself? Alone time means you do something without others bothering you. But why would you do that? Don't you want to talk? Not right now, Pearl. Okay, well, let's go play instead. Can't you see I'm busy? But you're not doing anything. Exactly. How can you be busy doing nothing? That's the whole point, Pearl. Well then, let me help you. I'll be Frankenstein and you be the mermaid, okay? Really, Pearl? Thor, what you doing? I am having deep thoughts. Oh, really? I had some deep thoughts once and I got scared. Pearl? There is nothing to fear. Thor, I think you're retarded. Pearl, it is not PC to say retarded. Then you're mentally challenged. Thor, I'm ready for summer. Oh? Yeah, because I like to chase butterflies. I like to pounce on butterflies. Thor, no! Pearl, could you, you know? Okay, I have to stretch a little. Mm, that's good. Yeah, my ear. Mm, very nice. Pearl, I love you. I love you too, Thor. Pearl, I'm excited to compete in the Olympics today, but I'm a little embarrassed about something. Oh no, what? Well, I'm having a little bowel trouble. I'm worried it might affect my performance, so maybe I should withdraw from the competition. But you trained so hard for this day. You can't back out now. I know, I know, but my belly is rumbling after all that turkey. Thor, real athletes don't let anything get in the way of victory. Plus, I want you to be there to see me do the high jump. I don't know. Just drink a little water and let's go. Okay, Pearl, but I might have to sit on the sidelines. And our first competitor in the high jump, Pearl! 
Wow, Pearl, that was amazing. You might win that high jump. Thanks. Maybe you can test your tummy out on this event. Just try a small jump. Well, the crowd sure seems to love you. Maybe they'll love me too. Okay, I'll try it. Go get him, Tiger, and be careful. Our next competitor in the high jump, all the way from France, Thor Francois. <laughs> Good job, Thor. Don't let that get you down. You'll do better in the next event. Oh, that was so embarrassing. Don't be a quitter. Just go out there and have fun. And now the three-yard sprint. Up next to redeem himself, Thor Francois. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That was humiliating. Pearl, I'm sitting out. Just go do your next event without me. Okay, fine. Good luck. Next up in the discus throw, Pearl. Well, that was awesome, Pearl. Good job. Thanks. How are you feeling, Thor? A little better. I went to the bathroom, so I'm feeling a little spunky. Great. Now go do your next event, and don't let this get you down. And now the long jump. Up next, Thor Francois. <laughs> Sorry, Thor. That was funny. Do you think I can still win a medal? Of course you can. Let me help you in the next one. And now for the main event, wrestling. Featuring Pearl and Thor Francois. <laughs> <laughs> and the winner of the Olympics, <laughs> that was funny, is a tie. Pearl and Thor take the gold medal. See, Thor, I always knew you were a winner. Aw, oh, shucks, Pearl. Thanks for believing in me. I learned the only way to accelerate to the top is to step on the gas. You know, I'm not sure if I should be offended if someone calls me a pussy. Thor farted. I did not fart. That was Paul. I have never farted in my life. I know he farted. I've never passed gas ever. I know he... The whole room stinks. And it was Thor. Thor farted. I didn't... Okay, okay. It was just a little toot. But I had some bad beef. I don't want that beef anymore. He likes turkey. Actually, I really like salmon. I like fresh salmon from Alaska. He's really finicky, too. And I know he fought it. This is my attempt at human impersonations. Oh, yeah. They can't touch me because I got the strength of a thousand men. Oh, yeah. Thor, I saw you last night. What are you talking about? I have evidence. Of what? I saw you smiling in Daddy's lap. Pearl, cats don't smile. Thor, I can't go poo-poo. I'm all backed up. I, oh, you mean you were constipated? I don't know what that means, but I can't go to the bathroom. I've been trying, but I, I can't go. Oh, okay, let's see. Oh, I have the solution. I listened to Mommy and Daddy the other day, and they said they were constipated, and Wait, wait, you understand what mommy and daddy are saying? Oh yes, yes, I am highly intelligent. And they were saying that they were constipated and they use this thing called flaxseed. They take that and then they say their poops are just coming out like slippery slope and uh, they feel a lot better. How do we uh, get some of this? Well, they have it up in the cabinet. I know exactly where it is, but we just have to get up there, open the cabinet and get out that bag of flaxseed. Seed. Oh, okay. Let's go and do it. Here, we got it. Take this, Pearl. This will help you. Thank you, Thor. Oh, yes. I took it, and uh, I took the biggest poop of my life. I feel so good. Thank you so much. I love you, Thor. I love you, too, Pearl. Thor, what's that thing that blocks the sun during the eclipse? They call that the moon. What's the moon? I believe it's a satellite that controls humans' brains, but not cats. This tastes like barbecue chicken. I'll show you my hunting skills. I am self-taught. Oh yeah, this tastes so good. I love wild game. I like it raw. Are you ready for the eclipse? Why, yes. What is the eclipse? It's when the sun plays hide-and-seek with us. What if the sun doesn't come back out? 
out. We have each other, Pearl. We have each other. Mother thinks I'm being cute, but I'm actually frustrated. This cardboard tastes horrible, but there's a sweet looking tabby that I see every day through the window and her name is Mary Ann and I'm so in love and I can't really talk to her because I'm not let outside that often, but she looked at me and I knew we had this special connection and her eyes are this special color of green that I've never seen before and it just pierced me through to my soul and only if I could just go out there and talk to her and maybe jump on her and Thor, you don't know what you're talking about. Pearl, be quiet. This is my video. So I've come up with this idea that I can woo her through a song I've written for her. Here goes, here goes. <clears throat> I, uh, Mary Ann, I love you. Mary Ann, won't you be true? Mary Ann, don't make me blue. Mary Ann, I love you. Mary Ann. If I get this song to her, tomorrow morning I'm gonna sing this to her. We'll see what happens. Bye. Watch this, people. I am faster than a cheetah. Thor, you dream too much. Hey, Thor, I had a dream that you were climbing a tree last night. Oh? Yeah, and I think it was the safari of Africa. Pearl, we're not allowed to climb trees. There's a tree in the front yard, but... Did you hear that? That was a lion from somewhere else, but anyways... But I don't know if it was a dream. It could have been reality. But did you climb that tree yesterday? Pearl, no, I did not climb the tree. But if I did, I wouldn't tell you anyways. Why? Because we would get in trouble, Pearl. And we couldn't have our little nibbly kibblies that we like. The little kibbly nibblies? Yes, we wouldn't get that. So if I climbed a tree, we wouldn't get our little snack. The snacks that we love. Oh, well, I won't have a problem because I would never climb a tree. But I, I, I don't know if that was dream or reality that you climbed that tree. Well, I lied to you, Pearl. I didn't climb the tree. My name is the Mighty Thor. I am beautiful. If you're beautiful, I'm extra beautiful. Dream on, Pearl. Thor, what's that? That is called a wildebeest. I, are you sure? Yes, I saw it on the internet. It's a, a wildebeest. I, I don't think so. I think it's a possum. No way, it is not a possum. It is a wildebeest, and I hear they make a fine meal. Do you think we can catch it and cook it? I don't think so. I, I still think it's a possum, though. No, it is a wildebeest. Trust me, Pearl. It, it must be a possum. No, it's a wildebeest. Possums are not brown, and they're not fast. Possums are slow, and they're dumb, okay? Listen to me, Pearl. That is a wildebeest. They come from Africa. Well, how do they get here? That's a good question. They fly through the trees. That's how they got here all the way from Africa. Thor, I don't think you're right in the head. Pearl? Trust me. Hey, Pearl, you want to do the boogie woogie? Not really, Thor. Why not? Because I don't know the moves. Ah, uh, come on now. It's easy. All you got to do is move your hips like this. You mean that's it? Yeah, but you got to put some feeling behind it. Oh, yeah. I'm starting to get it now. That's it, Pearl. Now just shake it a little. Yeah, like that. This is kind of fun. Woo-hoo. You go, girl. I'm the boogie.